In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how you can read your Secure Liberty 100 smart meter. To do this, I'll take you through a step-by-step -step explanation of how you can read your electric meter for regular and economy 7 tariffs, how you can read your gas meter, and how you can get some of these readings from your in-home display. I'm going to show you how to read a Secure Liberty 100 meter. If you have a regular tariff, you'll only need to use button number 9. You press 9 and you get IMP kilowatt hour and you wait and there is your reading. Usually you don't need to include the decimal place. If, however, you have a economy 7 tariff, I don't have an economy 7 tariff, so I can show you the start of it, which is you press button 6 and then if you keep pressing button 6, eventually you'll get through to IMP R01. That will be your first reading. And then you will need to keep pressing button 6 until you get IMP R02, which will be your second reading. So for an economy 7 tariff, you're looking at button 6. And for regular tariff, you're looking at button 9. So that is how you read your electric meter. We'll now look at how you can read your smart meter for your gas and how you can read it from the in-home display. To take a gas reading, all you need to do is press this number 9 and it will cycle through everything you need. So if you need volume in meters cubed, it will give you this reading. And if you wait, it will give you the kilowatt hours reading. So imp kilowatt hours, and there's your reading in kilowatt hours. And you can select the one that your gas company asks for. You can also get the reading from your in-home display, and that means you don't have to go around crawling in cupboards. And the way that you do it on a smart meter is at the top here, that's showing you gas and electricity. And you have the button down at the bottom here that lets you switch between the different displays. And so you can press that button and now that's showing us electricity. You press that again and there's your electricity meter reading. And this gives you it again in kilowatt hours. That's what your supplier is going to want. Then for the gas, you simply press this button here that switches between gas and electricity. And we've now got this little flame that's showing you gas. And this is the gas meter reading in kilowatt hours. If your company asks for a reading in meters cubed, then don't give them this reading. This is the one in kilowatt hours, so pay attention to those units. So you should now be able to read your smart meter. If this video has helped you, please like and subscribe below so other people can discover this video. And finally, thank you very much for watching.